Lukash Dr. Luke Gottwald's legal team subpoenaed Lady Gaga as part of the producer's defamation lawsuit against Kesha's credit, Kevin Mazur, Getty Images Entertainment Lukash Dr. Luke Gottwald's legal team subpoenaed Lady Gaga as part of the producer's defamation lawsuit against Kesha, who has, in her own lawsuit, accused Dr. Luke of sexual assault. In connection with Dr. Luke's defamation claims against Kesha's various third parties are being deposed by both sides, including celebrities, Gottwald's rep said in a statement, Dr. Luke's counsel served a subpoena on Lady Gaga because she has relevant information regarding, among other things, false statements about Dr. Luke made to her by Kesha. This motion has become necessary because Dr. Luke's counsel has not been able to obtain, despite repeated requests, s, a deposition date from Lady Gaga, a representative for Lady Gaga told Rolling Stone, as Lady Gaga's legal team will present to the court, she has provided all of the relevant information in her possession and is at most an ancillary witness in this process. Dr. Luke's team is attempting to manipulate the truth and draw press attention to their case by exaggerating Lady Gaga's role and falsely accusing her of dodging reasonable requests. Representatives for Kesha did not respond to Rolling Stone's request for comment. Lady Gaga has been one of Kesha's most vocal supporters during the TikTok singer's arduous legal battle with Dr. Luke, who Kesha initially sued in 2014 in an attempt to void her contract with the producer's Kemisabi Records. When Kesha's lawsuit was first filed, she accused Dr. Luke of sexually, physically, verbally, and emotionally abusing her. Gottwald, who denied all accusations, responded with his own countersuit accusing Kesha's of defamation, after a New York judge denied Kesha's injunction that would have severed her professional relationship with Dr. Luke. Gaga turned to social media to reiterate her support for Kesha. The very reason women don't speak up for years is the fear that no one will believe them or their abuser has threatened their life or life of their loved one's livelihood in order to keep their victim quiet and under control, Gaga wrote at the time. What happened to Kesha has happened to many female artists, including myself, and it will affect her for the rest of her life. No one needs to validate Kesha, she continued. Why is victim always the liar? Why do we let people in a position of power get away with behaving inhumanely? These guys hide behind the legal system and it's their litigious behavior that is precisely what they use to rape these girls. Give me what I want or else I will come after you and they have all the money and the resources to do it. Gaga was further roped into the Kesha Luke legal battle when Kesha's then-lawyer Mark Garagas insinuated on Twitter that the person who sexually assaulted a then-19-year-old Gaga, as documented on the art pop track Swine, was Dr. Luke. The producer then sued Garagas for defamation, at which point the